Please note that the following video is speculation and my personal opinion. Now that you know that, please enjoy the video. What is going on, you guys? Uh, today, I wanted to go over the infamous April 1st post from Christian Faber. Uh, he worked on Bonacle, if you guys didn't know about that. Uh, he was a lot of the, the concept artist. He really made the Bonacle feel very immersive. So, I wanted to go over the post he put. This was April 1st, but it does not seem to be a April Fool's joke. He put this post, this interesting bio, uh, I assume it is of a bigger letter due to how it's cut off right there at the O. And uh, his Instagram post read, What if there is an undiscovered way back? A secret path to reset destiny. How many of you would join? Hashtag 14B2020. He later, after, I don't know when he added this, but after lots of comments, uh, showing a lot of support. He later put, the wave of inspiration from one single post is truly amazing. You are the best. This is all the fuel anybody could wish for. Now, very interesting, uh, very cryptic, but I mean, bio, could it read Bionicle? Uh, it is definitely a larger word, and we'll get into that here in a second, but you know, it's very, very graphic. It's very beautiful looking, and yeah, but then he posted it again. So this kind of debunks the whole, is this an April Fool's joke? He put uh, another screenshot here, as you can see, uh, O-N. So it's the O from bio and an N. And of course, in spelling Bionicle, an N comes after the O. This one reads, and I quote, Amazing, there is only one thing to do after that response. This project is on from my side. And now comes the hard part. The leap of faith and airtime until it takes the right shape. So, I guess he's going to have to work on this or work. However, leap of faith he mentions. Again, this is uh, fully my speculation, uh, but interesting choice of words. It continues, one thing is for certain. This thing only got big originally because of your engagement. And it is made out of... The energy of the fans, hashtag 14B2020. Sorry, it's kind of small on my screen here, so it's kind of struggling to read it. But this is very interesting. And here's a picture of I edited together, as I'm sure many fans have and will. Both screenshots together. And I just wanted to go over uh, what could this mean. So here it is. As you can see, the screenshot right here on your screen. Uh, it looks interesting. One thing I wanted to point out is... It is, depending on what, of course, we don't know what the full art piece looks like, but the logo looks, it's cut off, of course, because it's only B-I-O-N, so potentially it's going to say Bionic, so let's not get our hopes up too much, Bionicle fans. It very well could be just kind of a red herring, make us think Bionicle, and then something new. I don't know, this is just my personal speculation, uh, but if this is does say Bionicle, and usually... Words and a logo are centered to the logo, so the O is not the center of Bionicle, so it's possible it says the Bionicle, or maybe it's shortened. Of course, I really don't know what the full picture looks like, but just kind of would seem to be weird if they continued Onicle, you know, Bionicle, way off to one side and then just left one side all, you know what I'm talking about, short. It just usually logos don't look like that, but you never know, and... Maybe it's something different. Of course, maybe this is just a screenshot off a much larger piece. So, what could this mean? Uh, what does 14B2020? Now, the only thing I could find, um, I searched up 14B2020, and it was nothing. So, I took the B out, and what came up was December 14th, 2020, there's a solar eclipse. Okay, cool. But, what does this mean? So, that's not... It's obviously not what it is. 2020 definitely sounds like 2020. Next year. 14? No idea. I have no idea what the B means. So if you guys have theories on what for, hashtag 14 2020 B, or no, 14 B 2020, leave it in the comments down below. I'd like to get this discussion going. So is Bionicle coming back? Now, I don't have the screenshots right here in front of me, but... I don't know, because he did reply, and you can go watch the TTV's, uh, the Three Virtues video on this, but he did reply back to some people saying that he's not Lego, and he's not in charge of products or sales or release. 
But he didn't say that Bonnacle wasn't coming back, so that's me thinking optimistically here. This picture definitely is interesting, and what Faber himself says is extremely interesting and very cryptic with that first message there. That's definitely interesting. So I suppose we'll have to wait and see what comes out of this. Maybe he'll continue to release more screenshots, and hopefully I'll continue to be able to edit them together. Maybe we can find ourselves a full picture. Maybe he'll release a full picture. I don't know. Is this Bonacle Generation 3? I honestly couldn't tell you. This is just speculation at this point. Do I think it's going to be Bonacle G3? Probably not, but it definitely could be something really cool. Like maybe he's going to get the license to do a comic book or a video game or a movie. Maybe Lego. Maybe he's going to go to Lego. Maybe that's the uh, thing he mentions, the leap of faith and airtime until it takes the right shape. Maybe that's what he's talking about. Maybe he's going to go to Lego or something. So we don't know. Again, this really, in the end, we could re see the full thing and it could say bionic. So, uh, yeah, sorry, but it very well could be. I mean, B-I-O in I. Say, if he releases the I, we'll think, oh, Bionicle, and then he puts a C at the end there, and it'll be, oh, you know, so. Yeah, so it very well could end up just spelling Bionic something, the Bionic, I don't know. But it'd be really cool if this is Bionicle. Anyway, I just wanted to make a quick video talking about this. Go ahead and leave your thoughts in the uh, comment section down below, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.